Today we're going to be talking about the ugly side of expose videos. Now you guys know that I've never been a big fan of expose videos, but I did do a few because I felt like it was worth making, you know. I made some videos about Tyler Doka, I made some videos about Perry the Preacher. Um, and if you go through my channel, you'll notice that I actually deleted a lot of those videos uh, because I felt like my channel was just becoming tacky. And I don't want the heart of my channel to be expose. I want the heart of my channel to be Jesus Christ. So um, I removed a lot of them and I just kept one or two videos on here. The ones that I felt like were the best ones. Um, but, you know, Tyler Doka was a guy who claimed he was Jesus Christ. Uh, Perry the Preacher was a guy who claimed that Jesus has reconciled sin for believers. So I felt like it was worth telling people, don't be listening to this. This is bad doctrine. Um, so that was my reason for doing that. But there is an ugly side of expose. And it, it, YouTube is a very ugly website, you know, for people to be mean to each other. Now, so we're going to talk about at least three different types of ugly expose videos. The first thing we're going to talk about is the slender type, the type where you're spreading stuff around that ain't even true. And you're trying to plant seeds of doubt within people's mind that this is a bad person, but you really don't have nothing bad to really say. All right. And, uh, you know, don't be surprised if you see a cat in the camera because he's sniffing around my Chromebook. But anyway, um... Caused me to lose my train of thought, kitty. Anyway, he had a tick in his nose while ago, or some kind of bug stuck up his nose. But anyway, um, trying to think of what I was trying to say now. So slander, okay? So there is a lot of types of slander out there, but I'll give you an example. There was a, um, there was a uh, girl who was... Um, Basically, she got murdered, all right? She was a YouTuber who got murdered, and I ain't going to go into detail who she is. Uh, but anyway, some guy or some woman, I'm not sure, started making videos about her after she died, claiming she was secretly a boy. She was secretly a devil worshiper. And um, when you look into these accusations, they were all lies. And it's like, who does that? I mean, this girl was murdered, and somebody's going to go. She can't even defend herself, and somebody's going to go and make up lies on her and say she was a boy, and it's not even true? Come on, kitty. Come on, buddy. Don't do me like that. Anyway, uh, sorry. Um, I'm the father of a bunch of kittens now. But anyway... Um, they keep making me lose my train of thought. Sorry about this. Um, so that's one type is slander. We should never be spreading anything on the internet that is not true. Um, the second part of all of this is um, when people are hypocrites. You know, they're trying to expose somebody for something they're doing. I'll give you an example of this. I'm not going to tell you who it was. But there was a guy who went around and he rebuked everybody for worldly hip-hop music. A true Christian should not be making rap music. That is worldly. Well, it wasn't long ago he introduced us to his very first rap song. And I'm like, what? He condemned everybody for rap music and now he's a rapper. <laughs> I mean, like... <laughs> oh my goodness. Stuff like that kills me, man. Um... So there's the hypocrite side of expose, too. Well, you're exposing people for stuff that you're doing. You know, a lot of people do this also for money. Like, they'll say, I don't like that person because they ask for money. They got a PayPal account. And then you go to their channel, and there's a PayPal account on theirs. And you're like, well, what? A wait a minute now. Are you meaning to tell me that it's okay when you do it, but it's a sin when everybody else does it? That's hypocrisy. So... That's it. Now, now I said at the beginning of the video, I think, that there was going to be three different types. But because my kittens is acting up, I can't remember what the third one was. <laughs> Hold on. Okay, I remember it. When you're making expose videos just to get revenge on somebody. You know, somebody made you mad and you're making the videos with no other purpose but just to get back at them. That's wrong too because the Bible says, Vengeance is mine, saith the Lord. 
So, you know, if somebody actually is teaching dangerous doctrine like claiming they're Jesus Christ or, or claiming Jesus has reconciled pornography for believers, by all means, shine some light on that. But um, don't do it with the wrong motives. Do it with the motives. I need to help the believers not be deceived by this rather than doing it with the motives. i got to get back at Perry because he called me a pedophile or whatever. And that's the reason why I removed a lot of my videos about Perry and Tyler because there was a little bit of uh, in there. I decided just to keep the ones that was exposing their teachings. So anyway, God bless.